Hey guys, today's video is sponsored by our favorite sponsor, Cozy Earth. I've told you before, I reached out to them, love everything they do. I love my bed so deeply, I wish I could stay in it all day long. <laughs> Stay in bed a little longer. Stay in bed. Stay in bed. Yes. Okay, so don't forget to like and subscribe. Here we go. Good job, again. Nice, buddy. Oh, best day ever. Did you know that the average person spends like 300,000 hours of their lifetime in bed? A third of your life. And so yes, these are, these sheets, this duvet cover, my personal new favorite, they are an investment, but one third of your life, that is worth it if you want to treat yourself. Or Mother's Day's coming up, your best friend's birthday, anniversary, this is a gift you cannot go wrong. I got these for my girlfriend's bachelorette. It's one of their robes, this silky soft buttery bamboo material that washes well, that literally is the best gift you could give. If you want to join the Cloud Club, use my code popcornandbed 35 for 35% off your purchase. The link will be in the show notes. Again, that code is popcornandbed 35 at Cozy Earth. All right, let's go back to bed. <sighs> Hi, guys. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to PIB Popcorn in Bed. If you're new here, it. Welcome. My favorite thing is to just sit in bed, watch a movie, and eat popcorn, mm -hmm. and or ice cream, and or chocolate. So, snacks on snacks on snacks. Popcorn, <laughs> popcorn in bed. Tonight we are watching <laughs> Tombstone. Um, okay, I, I don't know why I always feel the need to tell you how we got here, but this is how we got here. I just realized. What? I think in my head I was thinking Tomb Raider. Lara Croft. Yeah. No, it's no, not watching. I also, for about the first year of the channel, every time someone would be like, you should watch Tombstone, I'm like, oh, with Angelina Jolie, and they're like, no, and then it would happen again like a month later. Yeah. Yeah. I know nothing about Tombstone, so tell us how we got here. Okay, so, um, <laughs> top 50, there's a top 50 of Patreon requests, and I, uh, pulled out eight, but those on Patreon. Top four went to YouTube members, oh. and they picked Tombstone as the winner. Um, okay. By far and away. Second place was Interstellar, I think. Have you seen oh, that? Oh, I have. I did ish. I fell asleep. But oh. yeah, I feel like I know that that is an incredibly well made movie. Oh, for me. Yeah, it's. It, I heard it, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyways, Anyways, so Tombstone, Tombstone is our number two requested movie in the whole Patreon community. So out of. Wow. Yeah. What was number one? Number one is called True Lies. Okay. With Arnold Schwarzenegger. Kind of fun. Who knew? But Tombstone is our number two. So this is one I've been meaning to watch for a long time and I'm glad it won this poll. It is a Western. Oh! <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Like a Western Western. I don't know. Like I mean, a, it like is. Like our dad. I, it's in the 2000s. It. So it's like a. I think. It's like a newer Western, but they're all back in the day. Yeah. So. Wow, wow, West. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that was good. <laughs> it was good. Um, it was good. Okay, so I think it's like an updated Western-ish. I've only watched a few Westerns on the channel. Updated effects. 
old Western times. That's probably, yeah, you're probably right. Mm -hmm. Um, Val Kilmer is in this, and that is Ice all I Man. know. Yes. All right. And, you know, I watched Unforgiven with Clint Eastwood, and I watched The Good, The Bad, The Ugly with Clint Eastwood. And those I, Westerns too? Those are Westerns. And, uh, you know, from what I've heard, they maybe weren't the best Westerns to start with, but we're diving in here. Tombstone. If that many Tombstone, people Tombstone, baby. Requested, here we go. I believe. Yes, so true. I it's, think we're going to like it. At least a must watch. Yeah, right? Exactly. Exactly. It's must watch. Okay, so Tombstone. Okay. Don't forget to like and subscribe here, both. And Patreon is here where we're chatting out and having a fun chatting it up and having a fun community. Yep. Go and team. If you want to be notified when we have new uploads mm -hmm. and premieres, hit that bell here. Yes. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. Let's do it. Ooh, so comfy cozy. <sighs> The Civil War is over. Farmers, ranchers, prospectors, killers, and thieves seek their fortunes with murder rates higher than those of modern-day New York or Los Angeles. Out of this chaos comes legendary lawman Wyatt Earp. Oh, I've heard of him in other movies. Oh, really? You heard of Wyatt Earp? No. Tombstone becomes queen of the boomtowns. Attracted to this atmosphere of greed, Texas outlaws band together to oh. form the ruthless gang recognized by the red sashes they wear. Oh my gosh, it's a lot of history real quick. They call themselves the Cowboys. Oh my gosh. This is like Hell's Angels on horses? Yeah, a whole game? First organized crime. Yikes. Okay. Oh no, not on a wedding day. Guys, it's a wedding. Oh no, the red sashes. Y'all killed two cowboys. Oh my gosh. Is <laughs> in the middle of the town? Yes, all of a sudden you're just like, bang, bang, bang. Looks like we win. <laughs> Tell him to get on his knees. Just got married. Are they gonna put him on his knees to kill him? I feel like yes. <gasps> oh. Gracias. Okay, woof. These gross cowboys. Where's the good guys? The next time we come, you better step aside. Oh, cool. You're intimidating women and children. Yeah. You're so tough. Big shot. Uh, someone will come to revenge for him. Something like a, a sick horse who comes to sit with him. He talk crazy, you know? It's not what he said, you ignorant wretch. Spanish is worse than your English. Who's this guy? I don't know, but I think we're gonna like him. Yeah. You first. <gasps> no! Oh my gosh, did he take her? I feel like we need Zoro. <laughs> Was it the girl? Oh, probably. I guess we're not gonna like him. Was that the same guy? Yeah. He's quoting the Bible. Revelations. Behold, a pale horse. The man who sat on him was death. And hell followed with him. I thought he was a bystander, this guy. No, I just thought he was gonna be like the background ringleader of the group that was actually kind of good. Yeah. But then he just shot. Take away a group. Of... Did he have a red sash? This is a new character, right? I know, yeah. They all kind of look the same with their big mustaches <laughs> and hats. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Hurts, don't it? Going about your business. It's not Val Kilmer, right? I don't think so. It does look familiar, though. Yeah, I know. Mr. Earp, my name's Earp. Dake. Crowley Dake, U.S. Marshal for this territory. Forget it, I'm retired. I don't want the job, and that's final. I don't think you understand. I did my duty. Now I'd like to get on with my life. I'm going to Tombstone. Strike it rich. 
Never saw a rich man didn't wind up with a guilty conscience. I already got a guilty conscience. Might as well have the money too. How do they strike it rich in Tombstone? Silver, I think. Yeah, no, that's our face anywhere. Hey. <laughs> Virgil Morgan, my God. Okay, wait. He was from The Big Lebowski. I guess it's only right. Ma always said Morgan's the prettiest. Yeah, but she doted on the frowner. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. That's um. The guy from Twister, uh, Bill Paxton, I think. Oh! Uh, nice Aww. Hey, we know her too. Yeah. Don't talk. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for this, Wyatt. It's all you're doing. We'll make our fortune, boys. Found her. Same place we found ours, probably. That one guy is like, he is a cowboy. Like that. Oh, really? <laughs> well, I just feel like he's quintessential. Mm, yes. I think he's the, the guy from also the brother in um, the one with Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga. Country oh, one. I didn't see it, but I don't know. Oh, you didn't see it? Mm -mm. Good. I feel like everyone was Good. obsessed with it and I knew it was No. Sad. Makes me laugh. We know this guy. I know his I know. voice. I know. That's $500, Holiday. You wait around. Doc Holiday. That's who they said. Oh, oh yeah. I miss him. He came this way to drive the train. That's Bell. That's nice man. Kate, you're not wearing a bustle. On Holiday, you went around. I suppose I'm deranged, but I guess I'll just have to call. Do you think that girl's helping him cheat? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Isn't that a daisy? You son of a Billy, just settle down. Shut up. Take your money and get out. We cross. Without them guns, you ain't nothing but a skinny lunger. Wonder what that means. <laughs> yeah. Really was the wild, wild west. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Did he touch that gun? I'll burn you down. Oh, oh shoot! I calculate that's the end of this town. The horse is outside. <gasps> you recognize her too? Yeah, isn't that? We mm -hmm. soft Hungarian devil. But even I th then? I thought they said in the beginning Doc was a good guy. Yeah, I guess. Okay. He really ripped that place off. <sighs> Quite the wild start. How many times do you think we're gonna say wild in this movie? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is a cowboy on the left. <laughs> He kind of reminds me of mom and dad's friend who had like the long oh, mustache. Yes. Totally. Mm -hmm. And he was a cowboy, he yeah. was a farmer. <sighs> I just wish they could do something about all the dust. I don't think I could live well <laughs> in these days. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Back then though, it's all you would know. I know, but like... Nothing would ever be clean. Nothing! And just like, this just depresses yeah. me because of the dust! <laughs> Let's put some gravel down, maybe? Tombstone. Here we go. The city of silver. Pretty big, isn't it? Pretty big. <laughs> it's a street. Uh -oh, right. <laughs> Smell the silver in this town. They're all so excited about this adventure. I know. Three best friends. Sure. Just going off to get some silver. Name's John Behan, Cochise County Sheriff. I'm Wyatt Earp, and these are my brothers. Wyatt Earp. And Morgan. Dodge City. Gave all that up. His reputation succeeds him. Going into business, huh? Well, then, I'm the man to see. Side sheriff, I'm also tax collector, captain of the fire brigade, and chairman of nonpartisan anti Chinese. Whoa, do tell. You folks got a place to stay yet. Like I said, we just got here. Well, I also sit on the town lot commission. <laughs> you don't say. We got three lovely cottages coming up for rent. You're not going to find a better deal within town limits. I want you to meet Fred White. He's a town marshal. A lot of law around here. Yeah, he ain't no law. Only real law around here is the cowboys. I would have run in with a couple of them up in Prescott. You can always spot a cowboy. They always wear those red sashes. Cowboys are good for business. 24 hours a day, you got liquor, hostesses, gambling, making money hand over fist. All except the Oriental. That's a regular slaughterhouse. Even the high rollers won't go near it. What? There he goes. Yeah. This is the said the place where he said nobody goes. Yeah, but people are in here. Thank you. Kind of nice in here. Bill Joyce, owner operator. Where? Yes, sure. I said lay off the queen. Kind of dead in here, isn't it? See that bird at the faro table? I'll blow you right up that wildcat's ass. Do you hear me? He was barging in here one day, waving his gun around. Chase out all the high class play. Why don't you get rid of him? Get yourself a straight dealer. That's easy for you to say. Huh? 
That's the dealer who's acting like? Yeah, I think so. Something on your mind? Yeah, you're I just want to let you know you're sitting in my chair. It's a delight. Well, for a man that don't go healed, you run your mouth kind of reckless, don't you? No need to go healed to get the bulge on a tub like you. Just need to go healed or bulge on a tub. <laughs> Damn right you're scared. I can see that in your eyes. He's got nice eyes. Go ahead, skin it. Skin that smoke wagon and see what happens. I'm, I'm getting awful tired of your smoke. <gasps> I said throw down, boy. Oh! What the heck is happening? You gonna do something or just stand there and bleed? Uh, Does he want to get hit? I don't know. They have a backstory? Here, Mel. Keep safe. All right, youngster, out you go. Ugh. What the ear grab? What's <laughs> happening? He, he, he really, really commands a room. Really to him. <laughs> yeah. And I'm here for it because he was not great, but. Oh, what do you say, Mel? 25% of the house takes sound about right. <laughs> okay, like making deals. I like it. <gasps> oh, shoot. Why, Johnny Tyler! Mad cow. Doc? Where are you going with that shotgun? I didn't know you was back in town. Well, well. Small world. How the hell are you? <laughs> I am rolling. Virgil. Oh, Doc. What, Earp? His reputation. I know. Just leave that shotgun. Leave okay. It. The sheriff better watch out. These men are gonna I run know. this town. Mr. Holiday. Forgive me if I don't shake hands. This town could really use as a racetrack. Way ahead of yourselves, aren't you, boys? This is just another mining camp. It's awful Tony for a mining camp. Sophisticated. Oh my gosh! I know him. Hey, Sheriff. <laughs> yeah. What, Doc? They know the cowboys. Are those cowboys or the red sash have to be on the off there? Turkey Creek Jack Johnson, Texas Jack of a million. It was a fair fight. We was legal. I'm sorry, boys. I gotta take you before Judge Spicer. Hand him over. <laughs> I don't understand. Fair fight. <laughs> they had guns. Whoa. This town's the horses. Hello. Well, these are the sophisticated folk. <laughs> What kind of town is this? An enchanted moment. I like this guy <laughs> too. He's like always just passively aggressively um <laughs> condescending like, yeah. to this. He's got the look of both predator and prey. Oh, it's her brother. Yeah. Or <laughs> chauffeur. <laughs> I feel like this place is crazy. It's like everyone's drunk and having fun until someone decides to get mad and then it's like, gunfight. Yeah, murder. Yeah. Life over. See you in the street. Ready. Set with me. We haven't been to a show since years. Hopefully good. I'd like you to meet Mayor Klum and his wife. Your reputation precedes you. I was wondering if Not you a might prayer. Nice meeting you. So everyone wants him to help with law enforcement. Probably, yeah. Professor Gilman. <gasps> I love him! Aiden? Catch this. <gasps> Is it the guy that got off the I think so. Are they allowed to do that? The mayor's there. That's <laughs> oh, we're wrecking the roof! Oh my gosh! I'd take a deal and then crawfish and drill that old devil in the ass. <laughs> mm. Who was the devil? <gasps> is, is that his wife? I think so. A girlfriend. I don't know. I mean, that one guy said, well, yeah, she had to be newer because the other brothers had met her. All right. No, no, I don't want to keep you. Oh, really? I can stay a while. Is that the bottle Lou gave you? Yes, it is. Maybe you should see a doctor. <gasps> she was looking for something. Wyatt, it's just headaches. Everything's fine. Wyatt, look well. Definitely know her. Yeah, you I look know. Beautiful. And him. Oh. <sighs> oh, now we're in the mining business. You're the one, Wyatt. Turn into regular tycoon. Do you actually consider yourself a married man? Oh, yeah, pretty much. Okay, they are married. Yeah. Sooner or later, you gotta grow up. Also, and what would you do if she walked in here? She, you know damn well who I mean. 
The devil. Yes. I'd ignore her. I'll remember you said that. What? She's in here. Oh, hell. <laughs> ignore her. Wyatt. What if you were a person that couldn't grow a mustache? Would you just not? You couldn't exist in the wild, <laughs> wild west. I stand corrected, Wyatt. You're an oak. He's always looking sick. Well, he has tuberculosis. Oh, that's right. I thought tuberculosis traveled by mm, air. air. So, how is he not infecting so many people? Everyone in this movie looks so familiar. Yeah, mm. I know. Mr. Earth, would you mind signing an autograph for me? Oh. Uh oh. This Cowboys. guy's like the school bully. Yes. Wide herb, huh? Listen now, Mr. Kansas Law Dog. Law don't go around here. I'm retired. Good. That's real good. You must be Doc Holliday. Well, that's the rumor. You retired too? Not me. I'm in my prime. You must be Ringo. Deadliest pistol ever since Wild Bill, they say. I don't know. There's just something about him. Something around the house. Was that a gun? I think so. Aje Kuragis. Creda Judaia Sotella. Non ego. I hear the subtitles. I know, just says Latin. Yeah, I'm like, this is when we actually need him. Now I really hate him. <laughs> well, tricks. Ooh. I mean, I feel like I could do that too. Uh, I <laughs> definitely. <laughs> hey! He's gonna have a good comeback, I know it. Come on. But is he gonna be like annoyed and just shoot him? Because now he's making the crowd laugh. Mm -hmm. Just laugh and walk away. <laughs> Drinks are on me. Okay, that was like tense I but know. funny and I know. weird. It's wider. Better name for himself as a peace officer in Kansas. Very impressive. Mm -mm 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 -mm. He's married. <laughs> <laughs> More champagne. <laughs> It's so weird. I know. He's trying to hit on her and uh -huh. help her hit on him. I'm like, what is this? Oh, hell. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, boy. What are the chances? We've never actually met. Lighter. Yes, I know. I'm Josephine just... Josephine Marcus. Everybody knows. <laughs> that mayor's in season. How do they know? They know. It's the scent. No, I don't want this. Let's run it out of them. I'm an Shoot. Right Come on, Wyatt. Oh, nothing like horseback riding or walking in the field. Yikes. Well, this is pretty. End of the road. Seriously. I bet this is Alberta. They filmed Could be. so many movies in Alberta, especially yeah. cowboy movies. Mm. Oh, no. A picnic? Yeah, by the river. Under a tree. Oh, shoot. You could have been oh, killed back Oh, literally there. a picnic. Oh, Fetch. Are you happy? I'm happy. <sighs> Right into it. Happy as the next man, I guess. Touchy about it, aren't you? No, I'm not touchy. I just, it's a silly question is all. Am I happy? I'm always happy. Blonde woman, is that your wife? Yes. What do you want out of life? Oh, why? Big questions, oh. okay. <laughs> Make some money, I guess. Maybe have some children. I... Doesn't suit you. Well, I ought to know my own mind, and I'm telling you what suits me is a family and kids. Suits me right down to the ground. In fact, that's my idea, heaven. Oh. Your idea, heaven. Room service. I want to move and go places and never look back. Need someone to share it with, though. Why are you with him? Because he's handsome and he's charming. I don't have time to be proper. I want to live. I'm a woman. I like men. You're different. No arguing that. Go back to Maddie. But you're a lady, all right. I think she's trying to be like a cool girl. Yeah, you know? totally. Like, I like the guys and I like mm -hmm. cars. And... <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Is that the opium Lou gave you? <gasps> Why leave me alone? And where have you been? Just out. Uh, how are you feeling, Maddie? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, is she a drug problem? Alcohol? Or is she really sick? And that's yeah. What if we pulled out stakes and just moved on? You know, and we could stay on the move. Just keep going. See the world. Just live on room service the rest of our lives. How'd that be? Room <laughs> service. <laughs> Why stop trying to compare them? Nothing. Forget about it. What about the kids? Yeah. Your heaven? 
What's his deal? I don't know. This guy's scary because... Mm -hmm. He seems very unhinged. Yes. And not a lot of purpose in life to cause... I feel great. Okay. Mm -hmm. So just... just did drugs? Oh no. Should be low. You can't have guns when you're high. Remember, it's a lawless place. They're the cowboys. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Somebody's gotta do something. I believe you're the sheriff. Seriously. Why don't you just leave it alone? I gotta do something. Greta Bell! <laughs> Come on now. Well, howdy, Fred. Hand those over, Curly. He's so scared. You know. Here you go. Nobody's hanging anybody. He just killed a man. Gotta stand trial for it. Turn him loose. Uh oh, the cowboys. You said to turn loose of him. You want to get in on this? Yeah, I think the sheriff is actually the worst. He just likes a lot of titles. If you don't step aside, we'll tear you apart. Your friends might get me in a rush, but not before I make your head into a canoe. You understand me? He's bluffing. Let's rush him. No, he ain't bluffing. He ain't bluffing. You're so drunk, you can't hit nothing. In fact, you're probably seeing double. I have two guns, one for each of you. Back it up now! These are the pretty brothers? Yeah, oh. yeah. Huh. Who runs this town? I know, now I feel like they're gonna like kill them in their sleep. You, Ever a dull moment. She's like, I love that guy. Yeah, and she's like, and I'm with the man who did nothing. We're putting Curly Bill in jail. Yeah. I don't think the cowboys are like that, though. And now he's a target on his back, even though he's trying to be retired. <sighs> he can't. He's just too good. He says, well, did you actually see it? No, by the time I got there, Marshal White had already been shot. He says, well, you can't have a murder without a witness. <gasps> he's dismissed. Yeah. Excuse me, Wyatt, do you have a moment? Please, will you just hear now, me Now, hold out? on, Mayor. What about you? You were a law man. I'm busy. Barking up the wrong tree. A lot of decent people are suffering. But please, don't let me take up any more you of your precious time. You know him, too. Time. I know. Every this single movie one is, is familiar. insane. He's got some bad conscience. Yeah. For sure. Are they actually brothers? I don't know. Okay. Turning moment. <gasps> like a cowboy did that. Those whips, they're just. <laughs> no weapons? Is that what it said? Uh huh. Nobody's saying you can't own a gun. All we're saying is you can't carry a gun in town. Here, here. Yeah. <laughs> Town matter, what not town. the hell are you doing? I told you we weren't getting involved. You got us involved when you brought us here. I walk around this town and look these people in the eye. It's just like someone slapping me in the face. If we're going to have a future in this town, it's got to have some law and order. It's got nothing to do with you. I'm your brother, for Christ's sake. God, I don't believe this. Talk to him, will you, or hit him? He's with him. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, don't tell me. <laughs> Gotta back your brother's play. Wyatt! You can change the town! Say you're right. Say you don't get yourself killed. That's something else. All those years I worked those cow towns, I was only ever mixed up in one shooting. Just one. But a man lost his life and I took it. You don't know how that feels, Morton. Believe me, boy, you don't ever want to know. They're just trying to do the right thing, Wyatt. You're both making a big mistake. Come on, Wyatt! You're the lawman at heart. You're the one with the reputation. The Red River Valley. Oh, stop making so much eye contact. <laughs> Doc won't quit. He's been at it for 36 hours straight. Clan and the McClary brothers came in an hour ago. I tried to get him to go to bed, but he won't let go. Pull up a chair. He's trying so hard. Doc. Mm -hmm. Doc can go on day and night and then some. What is that now? The 12 hands in a row holiday? Son of a... Nobody's that lucky. Why, Ike? Whatever do you mean? Oh, shoot. That's Ike. Taking his part? I'm the one got cheated! You're all in it together. Nobody's in anything, Ike. You're drunk going home and sleep. Get your hands off me! Don't you ever try to manhandle a cow? You understand me? You can't. Oh, she threatened me. All right, all right. All right, come on in. He's very deep. I am scared of a lot of people in this yeah. show. What's wrong, Doug? 
That's a nice thing. What's wrong with him? Lunger. You are. Hope you die. Lunger. I think so. like just... Yeah, lungs too. Yeah. I see him on the street in Doc Holland. I'm gonna send them to hell on a shirt. Tell them that. I did not see him there. Is that? Guns up. Yep. No guns. Yep. In town. There's a new sheriff in town. Yes, there is. We haven't seen the ringleader in a while. Yeah. The one who shot. And then he went to jail, right but then away. he got out because there was mm -hmm. no witnesses. Yeah. It's because he shot at everyone else and they ran away. Up till he sobers up. What's the way you walk? It's easy, kid. I'm sorry. I ain't easy. I ain't your kid. You take sorry and shove it up your ass. They're just looking to pick a fight. Yeah. Now. You're gonna bleed. Okay. You got a fight coming. Oh boy. It's a verdict. Two years, two days, hard to say. You're smoking, you're drinking, you're gambling, your nightlife. You need complete rest. How are you feeling, Doc? Mm, better. I knew it wasn't nothing. I don't get her. Yeah, me neither. She just wants him to not be you, sick. You may be the Antichrist. <laughs> 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 oh uh, shoot. Uh oh. Damn, this is like a bad dream. Stay calm and use your head. It'll be all right. I don't want one of brothers to die. I will be. Guess maybe you better swear me in. <gasps> it's got it back, the brothers. Oh. <laughs> Custom. They're back there in that lot behind the OK Corral. What are you doing out of bed? The OK Corral. I had a nail polish called that. Oh. It was coral. Shoot out at the OK Coral. Oh my gosh. The good guys versus yeah. the bad guys. Oh. Oh, yep. Was that their place? Uh, I don't think so. I'm not gonna allow any trouble. He has to be the worst sheriff uh -huh. ever. What was that? Do you think she was taking a picture? Oh, I thought she was doing magic tricks. <laughs> Here to disarm you, throw up your hands. Oh, not what I want. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Ike. Do Tell him right to thing. get rid of the guns. No one has to die here. I think we're gonna break our heart here. We better not. In the chest. Yeah. Oh, shoulder. Shoulder. Right. There's the shoulder. All of you are under arrest. Um, they're sheriffs. So what? You don't. I don't think I'll let you arrest us today, Behan. Oh boy. Stop the eye contact. <gasps> oh shoot. Oh. Did Maddie run away? Yeah, and I don't even think he saw her. Like, I want them to be like, you have our support of the people. Um. Oh, shoot. That's still Pistol Bill. Come again? The fast, the best oh. Bill, the guy, the fastest pistol shooter or something. The one who shot the priest. Mm hmm. Yep. It's nothing like I thought. I almost wish I know it for they didn't want it to go like that. No, they just asked. Virgie even to... said, Yeah, I, I don't, don't want this. Happen. What do you want, Ringo? I want your blood. I want your soul. And I want them both right now. Okay, they can kill anyone they want, but yeah. they can't take it when it comes to them. Don't any of you have the guts to play for blood? I'm your huckleberry. Is that what this li that line's from? Is that a line? I'll put you out of your misery. Say wham. Don't mind him. He's just drunk, that's all. Gentlemen. Oh, Doc. I need to speak with you. 
I see what's going on between you and Wyatt. Now, after tonight, there'll be one man in charge of Tombstone. What? Oh, shoot. Good night, boy. I'm a little bit. No, do Oh, no. Oh, no. You know so what's going to happen? Is the sheriff in on this with the cowboys? Yes, I think. <gasps> he at least knows it's going to happen, and he's going to let it happen. Because he wants to take down these guys. Oh, no, no, Because he's no, a jealous no, no. little... Verge, no. <gasps> oh. Why'd they let him walk alone? Are you expecting someone? Only Verge. <gasps> she loves him so oh much. Oh, my gosh. I know it's awful to come here, <gasps> but listen. <gasps> I think something's going to happen tonight. <gasps> it's Verge. No! Is it? Where'd the guy go? Oh my gosh! What'd you forget? Has he been shot? Oh no! <gasps> Hurry with that water, please! He hit Clum's house too. Shot up his wife. His wife! What do you mean? What are you saying? I'm afraid your husband's going to lose the use of his arm. I still got one good arm to hold you with. <laughs> oh! Oh my gosh! Morgan, wait a minute! No, let's. <sighs> Oh, gosh. I heard about what they did to your women. Yeah. I'm here to let you know that it wasn't me. <gasps> the no. good one. Brothers to the bone, right, McMasters? Not anymore. He was the one that had that look yeah. of regret. <gasps> he threw down a sash. We're with you. <gasps> Where's Morgan? Right there. There's no painkillers. There's no anything. Oh my gosh! I'm sorry. You were right, Wyatt. They got me good. Don't let them get you, brother. You're the one. Morg? 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 Oh my gosh. Can't you see? Get away from me! Oh, I'm so sad about it. And so she walked out of our lives forever. Are they leaving? I don't know if they're. Or is she going to a funeral? the funeral? Oh boy! I want you to know it's over. Bye. Smells like someone died. <gasps> Screw you. I take still will and finish it. That's Virgil with the women. He's mine. <gasps> Where's Wyatt? Right behind you, Stillwell. <gasps> He's the one. What does that mean? Remember Morgan said he's the one that has to like... Oh. Is he staying behind? <gasps> oh. oh my gosh, does he say he's not healed? Is that what I meant? Oh. You see that? The cowboys are finished, you understand me? I see a red sash, I kill my man wearing it. So run, you turd. Red, tell all the other curs the lie's coming. Oh. You tell them I'm coming, and hell's coming with me, you hear? I love this, but I also don't want them to lose themselves and become like the next cowboys. No, they're they would they're gonna uphold the law. <gasps> that's quiet. I mean, they are only going after the red sashes, but this seems kind of crazy. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh! Is he surrendering? <gasps> okay, we still shot him though. <laughs> boys over there behind you. <laughs> hey, what? Mm. No. What? What are you doing? Come on, get some, boy. No. No. Now he's a target for everyone. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, taking. Oh, 
down by the creek. That's the one guy. Yeah, they were they were all helping him do all this. Yeah, I didn't I didn't recognize oh, him until yeah. now. If they were my brothers. I'd want revenge to. No, make no mistake. It's not revenge he's after. It's a reckoning. <coughs> Doc, what the hell are you doing this for anyway? Wide up is my friend. Hell, I got lots of friends. I don't. Oh. oh shit. Oh my gosh. I did not realize that there was this many cowboys. Me neither. My god. Are you alright? What do you care? Dear friends that did it. They tried to take my watch. He cursed them for cowards and they shot him. I don't understand any of this. I just know it's ugly. And he was beautiful. I'm not going with you. Billy! Billy, get Good. back! But we got to have some law. Billy! Yeah. Yes! Billy! Start the revolution! Uh-oh. Ringo and Ben are out front. Ben! Supposed to be a freaking sheriff. <gasps> Doc. <gasps> no! We got a sick man. Our horses are done in. Put him up at my place. As long as it's just tonight. Oh, phew. He's alive. <laughs> he looks pretty bad to me. Oh, boy. I think they're gonna have a moment. <laughs> I'm sorry about your friend. I'm sorry that I... I forgave you the moment you said it. Thank you. It was in a dark place when he told her to get up in front of you. Wait. In another life. Oh. oh. And now I'm okay with that happening because his wife's gone. Yeah. <sighs> and I feel like they split up in his mutual decision. Oh. Who's that? I don't... What the hell is that? Is he having dog? Oh my gosh! That's the cowboy we liked! <gasps> the remorseful one? Yes! He was a traitor to them. He wants a straight up fight, just you and him. Settle this thing once and for all. I liked that guy so much. He was the best. You tell him I'll be there! I don't like that we're doing it on Ringo's terms. Yeah, and I don't feel like the cowboys will honor just one on one. Mm hmm. After I'm done with Wyatt Earp, take your cowboys and burn them all. Now, for the first time, I know exactly what I want. And who? What does he need? Revenge. For what? Being born. Whoa. It all happened so fast with Curly Bell, I didn't really have time to think about it. I had plenty of time to think about this. I can't beat him, can I? No. Doc's the fast pistol. I'm going with you. Oh, Doc. Oh, Doc. I'm sorry, Wyatt. What's it like to wear one of those? Oh, wait. He's going in this knowing he can't beat him? He's gonna outsmart him somehow, yeah. right? He's waiting for you by the big oak. Okay. Something seems tricky. Yeah. Do you think they'll do like the one, two, three, turn? Yeah. The, real, the real duel? Duel from the movies? I didn't think you had it in you. I'm your huckleberry. <gasps> we started a game we never got to finish. I was just fooling about. I wasn't. He's scared of him. Yeah. Bleak. He knows. He's got nothing to lose. Mm -mm. Literally the wild, wild west. I have a prediction, but I want to read it. Say when. Oh. Whew. Come on. You're no daisy. You Did he know? I don't think so. I don't think so either. Wasn't quite as sick as I made out. I kind of adore him. Me too. <laughs> the last charge of Wyatt Earp and his immortals. Oh boy. <gasps> what? Do they still have to take care of? What? Be in. Oh gosh. He's really the worst. Yeah. Here. Ike. Ike. He's such a coward. I know. And he only gets so many, like, chances. Yes. So I, he's uh, been like, I surrender, I surrender, yeah, and then he runs Wyatt, back and joins them. Exactly. Wyatt has spared him too many times. What happened? Wyatt Earp and his immortals. There are no many portraits. What? Dog. <gasps> Dog. Dog. Oh, what? Well, Athene and I were just investigating the mysteries of the Church of Rome. I brought you something. 
Keep coming back here. I told you not to in a minute. You're the only person I can afford to lose to anymore. It's a good movie. Yeah. All right, how many cards you want? I don't want to play anymore. You're the most fallible, stubborn, bullheaded man I've ever known in my entire life. I call. You win. Yeah, with all. You're the only human being in my entire life ever gave me hope. Oh my gosh, wow. I was in love once. My first cousin. She was 15. We were both so. That's good, Doc. She joined the convent over there, yeah. She was all I ever wanted. Mm. What did you want? Just to live a normal life. There's no normal life, why? It's just life. You get on with it. Don't know how. Oh. Say goodbye to me. Go grab that spirited actress and make her your own. Take that beauty and run. Don't look back. Why? If you ever my friend, if you ever had even the slightest feeling for me, Oh. Leave now. Thanks for always being there, Doc. I'll be damned. Oh, this is funny. <laughs> oh. Here's the real moment. Oh, shoot. You ever see the sun come up over the Rockies? It hits all of a sudden, and below there's California. And you swear you're looking at heaven. I have nothing left, nothing to give you. I have no pride, no money. I, I don't even know how we'll make a living, but I promise I'll love you the rest of your life. What a speech. Don't worry, Wyatt. My family's rich. <laughs> May I have this dance? And then okay. we'll have room service. <laughs> ah, what a romantic one. Oh ends my up being. gosh. Ike Clanton was shot and killed two years later during an attempted robbery. Mattie died of a drug overdose shortly after she left Tombstone. Oh. Virgil and Allie Earp moved to California, where Virgil, despite the use of only one arm, became a town sheriff. Good for Virgil. That feels right. Up or down, thin or flush, in 47 years, they never left each other's side. Wyatt Earp died in Los Angeles in 1929. Among the pallbearers at his funeral were early Western movie stars William S. Hart and Tom Mix. Tom Mix wept. Wow. Okay. We just had an IMDb Yes, yes. I was just going to say. <laughs> we are sorry we didn't recognize so many of those characters originally. Kurt okay, Russell. It was just hard. With the mustache, yes. but of course. I knew him from the dad in Sky High and the coach in Miracle. I knew him as the dad in Guardians of the Galaxy and Kate Hudson's dad, Goldie yes. Hawn's husband. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, that wow. was pretty satisfying. And yes. I knew Maddie, or not Maddie, uh, Josie from Desperate Housewives. Mm -hmm. She was Catherine. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. And Maddie from Nashville. Mm -hmm. And yes. Anyways, let's okay. go on. We're satisfied. Okay. Back to I the West liked Street. it. Same. Like, I really enjoyed that. I'm not gonna lie. Like, you said Westerner, so I was trying to keep it open mind. But I really loved it. I know. I was entertained the whole time. It had like action and, and hard love stories and like family loyalty yeah, and, and like you want to be good. Yes. I really do love those movies that like at the end it kind of fills you with a sense of purpose. You're like, no, I want to let my life to have purpose. I want to do good. I want to like give someone hope. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Freaking Doc. Yeah. He just had like a presence about him. I know, him he really did. You just like were drawn to him. Uh -huh. And I mean, same with Wyatt Earp. I and I'm still a little confused at the beginning because I feel like, did he used to be an actual doctor? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but then all of a sudden he was like robbing. And then yeah. all of a sudden he's like, I'll be good now. I, I got my friend Wyatt back. <laughs> I'll be good. <laughs> Which is like, you know, that's so it's doc. Like so doc. <laughs> we know him. Oh man, uh, I just loved him. I loved, I loved those guys. Them strutting down I there, know. bearing the sheriff's badge, the brothers protecting the city, and like Verge. So yeah, yeah. Like yeah. he was the oldest, mm -hmm. and he was like, no, it's what we got to do. This this town deserves yeah. some law and order. Yes. 
Oh man, and we got that great love story at yeah. the end. Yeah, like and the I'm speech, glad. the kissing in the snow. It was kind mm -hmm. of beautiful. And I'm glad they left it till the end, and then like him and Maddie had split. Yes, because I was like, you kind of wanted to cheer for it at the beginning, but I'm I like, know. I can't. I know. So, and I feel like I they like were that. meant to be. They lived yes. side I by know. side for the next forty years. Oh, service. Okay, so is that a true story? I don't know. Were you thinking because of the line at the end? Yes. But like Hollywood actors, like yeah, yeah. I think so. I think yes, actually, because at the beginning it was telling us all that history. I think it was real history, like okay. that was actually the most like organized crime that I'd ever seen at that point. And yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Now I need to go back because I have heard so many Wyatt Earp references in other movies I've watched, oh. and I'm like, who is Wyatt Earp? And yeah. now I know. Oh. He's so a sheriff old. that you so just... educated now. Oh, I know. Feels um, good. Yeah. Feels good. And I feel like that line, like, I'll be your huckleberry. Yes! Is like a really famous line, and I've never known what it's from. And is this original, or is he quoting something else? I'm still not entirely sure, but now I know at least yep. somewhat portion of the line. I know. And I like it. Yeah, that was really fun. Yeah. It was, uh -huh. it was good. Who knew we would enjoy the wild, dusty, sandy west? <laughs> so much oh. okay thank you so much for watching along with us good pick guys great what pick. do you got next we'll see you soon